But here's the thing. I love gambling. I do. I really love gambling. But more than my love for gambling, I love to watch Chinese people gamble. Because when we gamble, it is very dramatic and entertaining. Okay? Every single Chinese person believes, sincerely believes, that we Chinese, we have the power to change the cards. <laughs> in our hands into whatever card we want. And how do we change the cards? Do we open the cards immediately? No! We open the card very slowly, millimeter by millimeter. Open, open, open. Open, open, open. And to increase the chances of us changing the card, what we must do, we must shout out the card that we want. If you are playing blackjack, the first card we open is ace. What must you shout out? Picture. Can you hear the sexual excitement when they all say picture? <laughs> oh, picture. <laughs> picture, 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 <laughs> open, picture, picture. And then guess what? While the guy is opening the card, people around will join in. <laughs> because changing the card is a team effort. <laughs> oh, picture, picture. <laughs> Picture, picture, yeah, yeah, picture, picture, yeah, picture, picture, come on, picture, 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 like Goku and Bola G were like, come on, picture, 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 picture. And guess what? If the card turns out to be a picture, everyone around goes ape shit. Picture, yeah, picture, 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 bro, you're damn skillful, bro, yeah. <laughs> if the card turns out to be not a picture, Something lame like four or five, right? Everyone also goes ape shit. Okay? Yeah, picture, picture, I have four. Bro, hey, bro you stupid, lah, bro. You don't know how to open the card. <laughs> you don't know how to open the card. As if there's any other way. You don't know how to practice the skill that we all just made up. Some games require, require you to ask to get a specific card, right? Like a, like a K or King, okay? And my friends, in KL, when they want to get a king, okay, what they will shout out is in Cantonese, okay, picture, picture, yeah, king, king, okay, Akong Lejo. <laughs> Akong Lejo is Cantonese, for my grandfather is coming. <laughs> because all our Chinese grandfathers, they're all Victorian kings. <laughs> all our grandfathers are white guys with beards and a sword. <laughs> One Chinese New Year, right? It's a family gathering. All my cousins were playing some game. I can't remember what game it was where you need the, the, kid, the king, right? So the whole night, Akong Lejo, Akong Lejo, but Akong didn't come, okay? So the whole night, they lost a lot of money. My cousins lost a lot of money, right? And their face were very black, you no know, mood very sour. And I thought, I was just watching. I thought, eh, not nice, you no know, family gathering, eh, all bad mood, right? So I thought, okay, I'm a comedian. I'm going to make a stupid joke. Relieve the tension, okay? So I made a stupid joke. I said, hey guys, the whole night, y'all keep saying Akong Lejo. Akong Lejo is Cantonese. Our whole family, Teochew. <laughs> when grandfather was alive, he couldn't understand a word of Cantonese. Maybe if you sit in Teochew, Akong Lai Leo. Maybe grandfather will come. And I took a step back, ha <laughs> funny, right? Funny, right? Funny, right? My cousins absorbs this as information. You can hear the gears turning the stupid brain, no? <laughs> hey, yeah, you're right, lah. Akong lai leo, akong lai leo, and fuck, the next card was a king. <laughs> I can change the cards. I can change the cards. 